Moto's Cades and Coffee. And good morning everybody, it's Andy from Moto's Cades and Coffee. Trying not to get eaten by a plant or a tree. But I'm gonna head on and I'm gonna go pick up an arcade game I've been wanting for a while. So hopefully this one's not a dry hole. Last two ones I've been to have been a dry hole. So yeah, hopefully this one's not. Um, I'm excited to go get this one. Not too far away and uh, about uh, an hour away. So let's go pick it up and I'll tell you what game I'm gonna go get. So I'm picking up a Lunar Rescue. It's not Lunar Lander, but it's Lunar Rescue. It's kind of a rare off game. I'm not getting a huge deal on it. It's absolutely appropriately priced, um, but it's a beautiful title cabinet and the, the arcade game looked in really nice shape and that, that makes a big difference. So I'm gonna go pick up this Lunar Rescue. Um, hopefully get some video gameplay. And I also have chores to do today. Those are paint chips, paint colors. I gotta get Rare Orchid, doing our bathroom. Yeah, you don't have to be there for the, the paint chips or the painting, but that's what I got in store today. So let's go pick up this Lunar Rescue. Looks like we got a big fire burning. Um, oily, black smoke, blend burning area maybe, yeah, I don't know, that's not good news, hopefully not too, nothing too bad. So I'm here with Scotty, um, we're going to go check out his uh, mini garage arcade looks like and uh, we'll go check out the game, so let's go take a look. Alright, we're going to go get some of the games looking at, hard driving is actually one of the absolute most fun games to play. Um, I'll talk about that when I hear it. Here's the game I want to get. So, Lunar Rescue, Title Cabinet. Nice shape. Stun Runner, one of the absolute most fun games to play. T Mac, both monitors work. That's pretty rare. Cool. And um, how long have you been into arcade games? So, I got into the hobby. Probably about five or six years ago. So I grew up um, with the National Woods Deluxe. My parents found that at a oh. yard sale locally, and they were nice enough to deliver to our house. Wow. So okay. we had that and had a repair tech come out uh, to fix it, offered us a free Star Castle. Okay. So I'm not going to talk, talk about what happened to Star Castle. <laughs> that Asteroids Deluxe went to my friend uh, when my parents sold their house. Okay. He now needed the room because he built a main cabinet and a virtual pitball cabinet. Do you want the game back? Of course not. So it needed work, and that started down the rabbit hole. Now I have this garage here, and I have eight more games upstairs. Eight, eight more games upstairs, you said? Yeah, all the oh, nice oh, right. Very cool. All right. Um, we'll take a look here. So unfortunately, Armor Attack just shut off one day. I mean, it's... Uh, all right. Donkey Kong over there, another recent pickup. Uh, Mike Messler again working on the chassis. Okay. Um, I have the virtual uh, vector lines multi game kit, so I have a Donkey Kong Junior. Oh, okay, yeah. The double Donkey Kong, is it? Yeah. yeah. Or, okay. All Very this cool. Fun stuff from, uh, so All right. I got a Star Cat, cat and it's working nice. The monitors, nice. I mean, that cat needs a little bit of work, but in due time. Okay, cool. Got a monitor up there. <laughs> yeah, it's the one that. Uh, yeah. So yeah, Everyone outrun. Loves outrun. Everyone loves outrun. And Absolutely. That has the version two ROM set in there, so you can turn off the traffic and you can make the oh wow, and all these fun cheats. To, uh, okay, cool. Got. It. This was a free pickup. Uh, F1 Got Super it. Battle. I don't. I don't think I've played this one. It's one of the cheaper kind of. Yeah. Okay. This is in a buggy boy uh, cabinet. Okay. A little, little freebie, so sure. Got it working, and it's actually a lot of fun. I bet it is. And of course, and everyone, Tron, Tron. everyone's favorite Tron. And this has the high score kit that also does. Okay. And that is my line, and I got a nice high score system. Very nice. All right. Well, cool. All right. Well, let's go check out the uh, Lunar Rescue real quick, and uh, maybe you could tell me a little bit about how you got this one. And. Uh, so I have had two games come to me free, empty packages. Okay. The first one was a Monte Carlo. Uh-huh. Same guy, uh, Zeke actually, uh, brought this one up. Um, empty cabinet again, no back door. Um, did have the power supply and some other minor stuff in it. The game board, 
all came from uh, Sasha, a uh, secret level cable. Okay. Um, including the manual. So, outside of that, it was fun to put this one together. There is a few things still missing from it, but again, thanks to everybody on cable. Right. They're getting parts, and once again, a great Mike Kessler <laughs> prepared the board set and the um, chassis. Cool. All right, and uh, basically he was offering it for a very decent price, which I appreciated, and uh, so we'll got to get a new bezel for it apparently. But <laughs> okay. You want to take a quick look at the upstairs? Uh, of course. Let's, let's go take a look. See, thanks. So well, here is the upstairs uh, arcade. I think he's turning the lights on. And everything. Oh, I already see some good ones in here. We got a lunar lander. I think this was a converted one, though, you said? Yep, this started as an app. Beautiful. Oh, I love the lights back there. That's so cool. The only thing original lunar lander on this is the game board and the marquee. All this rest of it is reproduction. Who did the uh, artwork for you? Was it Joe Susbo or? Uh, that came from Phoenix Arcade. Phoenix Arcade, okay. Uh, correct. Cool. Asteroids, beautiful. Asteroids look so wow. You got a. Some vectors going on. Oh, I love vector games. Good. Yeah. And like I said, this was the game I had as a teenager, so. All right. Very cool. Yeah. Is that the exact game you had? It's the exact one. So awesome. So you've had this how many years? I would say it was late 90s, I think. Wow. Early or mid, you know, late 90s. Very cool. And what do we got on Astros there? What's the. Uh... That's a high score uh, save, save kit. Online. Okay. So yeah, it's not online right now, but. Okay. Gotcha. And obviously Lunar Lander, which is uh did did a good job on that one. Thanks. Oh, yeah, very was, cool. Took a lot of this is a hard game to play. Holy moly. It is. It's also <laughs> as uh <laughs> pretty much correct. He's pretty right, yeah. <laughs> it's it's pretty tough. All right. So what do we got on this side? Monte Carlo. Monte Carlo. Oh that is so cool. Look at that. Look at that cat. Tari made some fun, fun games. Oh yeah. Turbo 2 or Turbo with it, yeah. Yep, Turbo right. works really well. I do look how to put Battle Zone. Again, Mike Kessler was working the boards. Battle Zone is an amazing, oh, that's a so fun game. Oh, it is. You got a nice step there, it looks like. Very cool. All right. And of course, a Pac Man, because Arcade is not complete without a Pac Man. Oh, and, yeah. and a Paper Boy. Boom. And again, the Pac-Man is an online save kit okay. with a multi-game in it, so... Okay, cool. Gotta have those. Okay, very cool. All right, well, I like it. I love what you did with the lights. You got all sorts of arcades up there, little mini arcades and all sorts of good stuff. A lot of those were uh, games that we got my brother and I as uh, Christmas gifts, so... Oh, no way. So they're kind of all original, too? Almost all of them. Wow. Right? And again, thanks for uh, letting me uh, see your uh, both arcades. Cool, thank you very much. Appreciate it. All right, we'll go load that game up. All right. The Home Depot. Rare Orchid awaits. Boom. They're very hard to keep running well. It's been running very well, thankfully. You do need to put a uh Pot. Zero ram chip in there to okay. save the settings, but it does work. So, again, I think what I really like about this game is it actually drives like a real car compared to some of the newer ones. The feel of the controls is actually yeah, the shifter. Can, and Yeah, you can turn the intensity of that steering wheel up where right. it is now, and it's, it's fierce. If, yeah, yeah, and then the shifter feels like a real shifter, unlike new games that would, you don't have yeah. it, so that's cool. 